Also, Daigo Kobayashi gets a start. Well, true number nine up top, Charlie Davis leads the line while his hold-up play is excellent and has pace to stretch any back line. Oh, the player for me, number six, Darlington Nadby. We have him out wide. He could float inside. He's dribbling and tight control of the keys to his game. Smith. Fagundes, two goals on the season to lead the Revs. Gets it back from Wynn. Lee, oh, nice pass. Diego in the area. And it's finally cleared by Jermaine Taylor. But the Revs have it again. Win from distance. Bounces it just wide. Gleason, the Kiwi. Going to his left, wasn't taking any chances. Wins out swinging delivery. Not clear by Portland. Low hard shot by Farrell, blocked by Chara, and the break is on. Nagby, inside out ball, finds Milano. Rez gets some numbers back, but it's a good ball for Adi in the D. Takes a shot, bends it wide. It's wide. Fast field tonight, they had the... Uh, Super cross in here a few days ago. Look at this run. Watson cuts it back. Rowe loves this range, curls it over the target. That's that confidence we were talking about, Brad. If Kellen had a little bit more confidence about himself, I'm sure he would have taken this on first time as the ball just rolled into him here from Watson. Great work by him. Just bouncing just a little bit. Maybe he felt as though he had to just have that, that touch. Roll it with the sole of his shoe. Towering header there by Gonsalves. Agadello stripped. Chara, a good defensive midfielder. That's Taylor. Now Nagby on the ball with Clutie to the left. Clutie's delivery. Important intervention there by Farrell. And then it's cleared by Smith. Taylor's header finds Nagby. In 2016, and we are underway. Angled for Juan Agudelo. Fortuitous bounce for Rowe. He takes a shot. Gleason with a good save. There for Scott Caldwell. He's been such a consistent player. I'm sure Caldwell disappointed to not be facing his former college coach, Caleb Porter, tonight. I know Caleb Porter is proud of uh, Caldwell. Nagby. Barnby. Bouncing ball. That's going to find the back of the net. Wow, the substitute, Jack Barbie comes on to score. It was an excellent break there. Addy played Nagby in. Nagby dinked it right to the far post. And it's, it, as is always the case, a miss hit ball on the volley. He doesn't catch it right. It goes over the top of Shuttleworth and into the back of that net. Unfortunate for the referee, uh, for the revolution. But Barbie. Bambi there, just mishit it, and it just goes into the side panel. He plays hard. Rowe. Kellen's delivery. There's a man at the back post. Watson squares it, it's loose, and it's in! The Rams have equalized! And now they want the ball back. I believe it's Femi. Here it is, there's Donnie Smith. Kellen Rowe opens up, pumps it to the back stick. Does Javon Watson cuts it back? It gets touched on the arm of Gleason. And Femi doesn't really know too much about it, but he's not bothered. He gets the equalizer. It could, oh, that could actually be an OG. He's grabbed, <laughs> he's grabbed he's the grabbed player by, both in shoulders, by yes. the neck. Yeah, fair enough. And the referee is blown for full time. So 1 1 unsatisfying, but the Reds remain unbeaten.